right, it Yay. is Christmas time. We got ourselves a bunch of gifts. <laughs> Tiffany got me one. She knows me so well. I can't wait to look at this. It is a... Like a pot holder. Oh, okay. Or you can put hot things on it. I knit it myself. It's amazing. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Do you like the way Tina Fey looks there? Yeah, I do. I think it looks Okay, open mine. I already saw it. Oh, no, no. That's, you got me this no, no, that's mine. Print. I bought that for myself. You go, please. Okay. I wrapped it myself. Oh? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Jerk Get pills? your finger off the nose. At least you're calling yourself a jerk, so. No, that. it's to make you better in life. Now, what about Dan? I got myself a present because I'm my own secret Santa, and I know what it is. It's a sandwich. And this is movie threesome. Movie threesome. I almost bit the toothpick. Happy holidays, I'm Christian Harlow. Merry Christmas, I'm Tiffany Smith, and I hope you guys are having an awesome Christmas Eve. And joining us for this very special holiday episode is our friend Dan Peralt, who is full of Christmas cheer. Yes, I am, and not pants. Why aren't you wearing pants? Well, to be honest, this costume surprisingly didn't come with pants, but I think it's a Christmas miracle. I think it's wonderful. I yeah. think it's the opposite of a Christmas miracle, mm -hmm. and I don't want to see your jingle balls. Because it is Christmas Eve, we decided to do a holiday list with a twist. Wait, what do you mean a twist? Oh, Dan, tell it. We were talking about this. I mean, we could do a list of movies to watch with your family over the holidays, but how about a list of movies not to watch with your family? Like movies where the elves don't wear pants. Hmm. That would be that? a great film, and we're making it right now. All right, I'm scared. You should be. Okay, five movies not to watch during the holidays with your family and when to watch them. I think the obvious one, Fifty Shades of Grey. Now, I actually enjoyed this movie, but it does get a little saucy at times. Not one for the kids. Lots of graphic action. I feel like the leads have more naked screen time than non-naked screen time. Not one you want to watch with your parents. Although I had a wonderful time watching with your parents, Christian. <sighs> Best time to watch this movie, Valentine's Day, if you have a date. If you don't, then it's, then it's weird. Uh, no judgments. I'm going a little franchise here. I'm going either Magic Mike or Magic Mike Double XL. And I know, I know. You think, well, is there magic in this movie? Not necessarily, because you have elves. There's no elves. There is There's magic. no magic. There's just magic. a bunch of guys. His name is Channing Tatum. Sure. <laughs> Where you're going to watch this movie? It's more of a girls' night or guys' night. But I will say, this is not necessarily one you're going to watch with the kids. Next up, I gotta say John Wick. Now, with 80 plus on-screen kills, definitely more of a guy's night movie, I'd say. Uh, not one for the parents. He does get a cute puppy at one point, but the cuteness ends there, unless you think Keanu Reeves is cute, in which case the whole movie's adorable. I am actually probably gonna watch John Wick with my family this Christmas. Really, really? I don't know what that says about us, but. Is that your new Christmas Eve tradition, John, John Wick? No, oh, we just like action films, Wait, so that's not one like of them. Dogs? I do, do I do. Do not like puppies? Oh. He's avenging a dog the whole movie. All right, well, Tiffany, what do you got? Come on, okay, you got something so for fine. us? Okay, so fine, I will get in on this. My list addition Is The Little be, Mermaid 2? That doesn't count. I would say The Human Centipede. Wow. Or any of the sequels, because they're just like those seriously gross out movies that kind of go almost campy. So if you've had a big holiday meal, it's not the best time to watch that movie. But I do think you could watch it with a big group of friends over Halloween. Wow, I did not expect you to say that. Um, now I really want you to react here because I want to see how you like my choice here. Okay. Nymphomaniac Volume 1 and 2. I don't even want to hear yes. about it because there's no good time to watch this movie. So I don't want to watch the clip. So I'm done. I'm uh, done. Gone already? You've ruined I Christmas. Get to tell you I don't want to watch the clip. I, I don't want to hear about go it. Go ahead, I'll explain it. Okay, oh, so here's why. So Nymphomaniac Volume 1 and 2. Go. Lars von Trier directed this movie. Nymphomaniac. He's shocking. Your uh, Nana and Pop Pop will never be able to, their hearts won't be able to stand it. There's just too much going on, a lot of sex. But the reason I brought it up with Tiffany, Tiffany has seen this movie. No, I like have it. not. Shut it, Grinch. She it Just every a couple night. minutes. Run the clip on the Schmoes No movie. She loves it. No, Man, no. You gotta watch. No, you gotta no. watch. No, no. Keep, no hey, no shield in the end. There's 15 minutes. Treat. You can't treat. I don't want to see this. You gotta 15 see it. Minutes. I really don't want to see it's this. It's art. It's art. <laughs> I don't know why you chose that clip. You know that I hate that movie, and I couldn't even take a couple minutes of it. It's Christmas. Why would you wear Christmas? You know, Christmas is like my favorite time of the year, and you ruined it. Like, I don't even understand. We talked about the list and you're doing this they like are, you know they're rolling right now it's just fun Smi see look the smiles back Merry now Christmas. okay goodbye bye bye okay let's just end this happy holiday so you've heard our list of the movies not to watch with your family so why don't you guys let us know some of yours in the comments below although i would recommend watching creed the good dinosaur mm -hmm. force awakens which by the time this airs i'll have already seen like nine times true, me too. quick favorite holiday movies uh, I will definitely have to go with White Christmas. 1972 Scrooge. Wow, Christmas story for this guy. 
great. Awesome, mm. you guys. All right. Thank you so much for joining us for this awesome episode. Thank yes. you, guys. And I, uh, this is weird. You guys got okay. to do the legs thing. If I you want to see more too. of these beautiful holiday legs, make sure you follow at Dan J. Peralt. How about right there? That's what you got to do. You subscribe right over there. Check out more episodes of this show right here. And then download the Fandango Movie Clips app on your smartphone. And then join us next week on... Movie Frisa! Oh, also, wait. I bought these shoes for myself on your credit card because you got me such a bad present.